Hi there lovelies, welcome back. So first off we're going to start off by putting Makeup Geek's Creme Brulee in our crease. Next up we're going to go in with Makeup Geek as well and this is in the shade Barcelona Beach and we're just going to be going just over top of Creme Brulee. This isn't really adding much to the look, I just wanted a little bit of dimension. I'm going to be doing wing liner, hence the tape, and I'm going to be using Tarte's So Fine Liner. I'm going in with the Lashes Iconic from House of Lashes. For primer, I'm going to be using the Hourglass Ambient Mood Light. This was the first time trying this primer and I actually really liked it. For foundation, I'm going with the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Stick. I love this foundation, I think it is beautiful coverage and the shade lines are amazing. I'm going to be blending that out with the Morphe M439. Next up, we're going in with the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Concealer. I'm blending that out using the Real Techniques sponge. I'm going to set that concealer using the Cover FX Matte Setting Powder. I'm also going to put that all over my face as well. For bronzer today, I'm going to go in with the Kat Von D Shade Light Palette and I'm going with that middle shade. using the contour from the same palette as well. I'm just going to bake underneath my contour using that cover effects powder as well. I'm not going to let it sit there though, I'm just pretty much brushing it off straight away. And for blush, I'm using Makeup Geek's Summer Fling. I'm 
I'm going to go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in Gleam and I'm going to be using the highlight shade Crushed Pearl. So for the lower lash line today, I'm going to be going in with the Morphe 350 palette and I'm just going to be using that dark brown shade. I'm just going to be putting this tight up against the lash line. I'm going to be going in with that ready orange shade and I'm going to be putting this at the top of the outer corner. I also did my eyebrows off camera guys because I find our brows pretty boring to do but I just used the Anastasia or Beverly Hills brow definer. I'm using a small Morphe brush and I'm just grabbing the same colour and I'm just going to be going up against the, that wing as well. Now I'm going to go in with Makeup Geek's Chickadee. And I'm going to be putting this more towards the inner of the lash line, blending that darker orange shade together. Creating like a sunset look. Now I'm going to be putting mascara on my bottom lashes and I'm just using the Bobbi Brown one. This one's probably my favourite mascara. I'm going to be lining my lips with Max Whirl. And I'll also be filling my actual lips in with this as well. Then I'm just going to be going with a little bit of lipstick and I'm using Max Japanese Maple just to give it a bit of a shine. Then I'm going to be setting my face using the L'Oreal Infallible Fixing Mist. And with that, it completes the look guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, this was not something, you know, over the top dramatic, but it was just a bit of fun to do. So please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe. And I'll see you in my next one. See you guys.